I am an ethnobotanist and I have been working with the sacred stone camps from the very beginning. I have seen the absolute wealth of incredible medicinal and edible plants that are right there in the path of that pipeline. And so um, I could see what was getting destroyed. To a lot of people, as they drive by, they might just think, oh, it's just grass. It's not just grassland. There are sacred medicines there, such as echinacea and gustifolia. In Lakote, they call it ichach behu. And um, it's a beautiful medicine that you can use uh, anytime you're sick to boost your immune system. It's great for sore throats and toothaches. Um, it's probably one of the top 10 most important medicines of the Lakota people. And there are literally thousands of them getting bulldozed by Dakota Access every day. This is just devastating. When I pray, I actually apologize to the plants. And, you know, plants have spirit. They're a nation in and of themselves. And um, I apologize to them for not doing enough to protect them. Um, for not doing enough to protect them to this point. But I know that we can stand up now. We are stronger than ever. And we know that, that the foundation of this entire movement is on us, it is on our shoulders as women. I need to stand up and walk with power and hope just like I was meant to.